Hello and welcome to our video series on cPanel. In this video, we'll be showing you how to install the Coppermine Photo Gallery. Now remember, as you're watching this video, you can always use the pause and rewind buttons below the screen to watch and rewatch this video until you have this task mastered. So let's get right to it. Now the first thing we need to do is to log into our cPanel. That'll bring us to this page. Then we want to scroll down to about the bottom of the page and look for the icon that says Fantastico. Kind of a blue smiley face. Now yours might say Fantastico Deluxe. Either case, same thing. Just click on that link. That brings you to this page. Now over on the left hand side you'll see a whole bunch of links. A lot of good stuff in there. But we're interested in the one that says Image Galleries. So we scroll down almost to the bottom of the page on the left. And more in particular we want the one that says Coppermine Photo Gallery. So go ahead and click on that. That brings us to this install page for the Coppermine Photo Gallery. Now you want to click on the new installation link here. And up at the top, you want to either enter a subdomain or leave it blank. And your main domain will be the address for the Coppermine Photo Gallery you're creating. Now here, you want to enter the username for the admin account. Probably a good idea to write all this stuff down unless you got a photographic memory. And here you want to enter the password for the admin account. And here you want to enter the site name. And then the site's slogan. And then the uh, email address for the admin account where you will be receiving the email sent to you. And then we just click on the install Coppermine photo gallery button here at the bottom. Just about there. We're on the downhill side of things. Almost done. Now up here at the top we just click on the finish installation button. Now we can click on this link here to check whether Coppermine is installed properly or not. And of course you should also save this URL in a safe place. Probably the same spot you got your password and stuff written down on. And this page shows the Coppermine photo gallery was installed properly. Now let's go ahead and close this window. Now we can click on this here that says back to Coppermine Photo Gallery Overview. Let's go ahead and click on that link. And this shows that the Coppermine Photo Gallery is installed on the system. Now if you want to get rid of it or just start from scratch, click on the remove link, <coughs> excuse me, over here on the right. That'll basically erase everything we just did. And up here at the top, click on Remove Coppermine Photo Gallery. It's kind of a safety measure there, so you don't accidentally remove it if you didn't want to. Then click the Back to Coppermine Photo Gallery Overview button. This is kind of like where we started at. This shows that there is no Coppermine Photo Gallery currently running on your system. And folks, this brings us to the end of this video. We hope you found this video informative and that you'll be more confident the next time you open your cPanel control panel. Thanks again for watching this video. Oh yeah, and for a wide variety of these training videos and a constantly growing selection, be sure to visit our sponsors. And have a great day. Thanks again for watching.